Ah, yo, 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 yo. Fam, where do I even start today? Because I'm going to do a mad thing today. Well, I'm going to try to do a mad thing. This might not even be a mad thing, but I'm going to try to be, I'm going to try to do a mad thing. Do you get what I'm saying? I'm not going to lie, yeah? I'm going to say this quiet, innit? There's a guy next to me, yeah? Hopefully you can hear him. To my right, yeah? And it's literally, it's two degrees, innit? And this guy has a vest on him. Can you see him? He's behind me. I think he's behind me. Can you see him? He's got a vest on. Fam, I need to be built like that because that's crazy. In this weather, I literally just took my jacket off. I literally ran. I warmed up and now I'm ready to go. But fam, a vest in this weather? You're having a laugh, mate. All right, calm. So guys, yesterday I was looking at like exercises I can do. So I'm going to do an AMRAP to warm up, which means as many rounds as possible. I'm going to do... Obviously, people do higher reps, but I'm not strong or lighter yet, so I can't do bare reps like that. So I'm going to do five press-ups, then I'm going to do four dips, and then I'm going to do four pull-ups, and I'm going to do four, four rounds, but I'm going to change the pull-ups to chin-ups, pull-ups, chin-ups. So it'll be two of each. So it'll be eight of each in total. Do you get what I'm saying? And I'm going to do the dips on the high bar. I'm not going to use the, um, the low bar, this one I'm sitting on. And with the press-ups, should I do it on the floor? Or should I do it on the parallel things? Because I always do it on the parallels. Should I carry on doing it on the parallels? Or should I do it on the floor? Actually, no, I'll do it on the parallels because I feel it more on the parallels because I think you go lower, innit? So, yeah. And this is working on, like, endurance and stuff. Guys, if you, if you literally want to do this, you can do it. Do five press-ups with me, then do five dips on your chair while your kitchen table these ones yeah and then do five burpees uh yeah do five burpees yeah let's go it's gonna be hard but let's go okay set number one five one two three four five elbows forward Set number two. Let's go. Elbows forward, guys. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Set number three. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Last set. Five. One, two, three, four. One. I'm using this one. Four dips. This one's narrow, but it feels it. Let's go. Cooked. Okay. Okay. Three. Four. 
I can't. That was the first am rap I did. Well, the only one I'm doing today, because I'm not doing another one. Now I'm going to do like pike, press ups, push ups, and core stuff, and some more pull ups and dips. Working on the technique. Because I saw some comment, and it said, I'm sweating, I don't want to move. And it said, um, well, they said that you should work on like the fundamentals, basics, push ups, press ups, squat, press ups, squats, dips, and pull ups and chin ups for at least four months. So we're going to be doing this for four months, guys. Yeah, the reps might increase and we might do a few cool things, but we're going to stick to the basics. A lot of pike press ups, they said, to build the shoulder. So when you do go on to advanced things, it's not hard. That makes sense. But I'm a bit tired. And yes, it's Thursday today. It's not Wednesday because I said I was going to come on Wednesday. But then they said with stuff like this that always take rest. If you need rest, take it because you don't want to come and mash yourself up. What to be honest is fair. So I didn't do it yesterday. I went to the gym, but I didn't do, um, I didn't come here yesterday because I wanted to rest to make sure I can do today good. Do you get what I'm saying? That makes sense, innit? But yeah, we're gonna go on to the next thing. I don't know what it's gonna be. Some holds, static holds. Let's go. Guys, I hate sweating in the cold, man. You just feel freezing, like. But let's go. Um, hold. For just as long as possible. Let's go. Okay. Oh. Set two. Hold. Come on. Come on. Set free. Okay. <sighs> Guys, you see static holds here? Yeah? Do you do them in the pull up position? I mean, the chin up position as well. Does that must work your bicep more? Obviously, I can feel it in my bicep when I'm doing. Um, What's it called? The pull-ups, holding it, but like, do you feel it more when you do it chin-ups? Do you get what I'm saying? My hands are absolutely freezing, guys. That's why I'm standing here. I don't want to move, and my back is wet, so my T-shirt's wet. Okay, I sound like I'm making excuses. Come on, man, pattern up. Tee up, tee up. But yeah, like, holding, holding it in the pull-up, like this position, like this, I'm guessing, yeah. It has to work your bicep. I can feel it. Wait. Yeah, I can feel it. That definitely. Your forearms as well, innit? And your upper back. Should I do some? It's gonna be hard, but should I do some? Okay, let me do some. Okay, I don't know how well I'm gonna do these because these seem harder. Okay. Whew. Let me focus for this one. This seems like it's gonna be hard. All right. Wait. Grip it. Oh, I need to take longer rest in between sets, man. I'm going too quick. Yeah, man. Pause. Pause, brother. I'm going too quick, man. It's making me fatigue quicker. Obviously, I'm going to fatigue anyway, but going so quick is making me fatigue quicker. What is that? Oh. Yeah, man. I'm gonna slow down in between sets. Relax. Think about life. Focus. Stay disciplined. Chill. All right. I'm gonna be ready soon. All right, let's go. Whew. One, two. I'm gonna do some pikes for a bit because my biceps, oh, my biceps are done. Them holds, that was the most holds I've ever done. So yeah, I can feel it. I can really feel it. I'm gonna do five sets, I mean five reps, maybe three sets. I'm gonna try to do good form. Obviously it's not gonna be perfect form, but I'm gonna try. 
Alright, let's go. Alright, let's go. I need to push my elbows forward. Yeah. One, two. No, I need to stay back. Mate, this is so hard. Alright, next set. Let's go. Elbows forward. Up. Okay, just stay in this position. One. Here. Two. Three. Four. Five. Last set. Come on. Alright, calm. Before I even start these hill runs, I'm not doing no more in the gym today because, like, my arms are tired, didn't it? Well, my body's a bit tired. And they, all, they, they do say rest, like, if you're tired, rest a bit. And also, most sessions I've done so far, I've pushed to the limit. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, I went from five dips to 30 dips in the space of a week or two, something crazy. And fam, fair enough, yes, I could have kept going, but my point is, like, you don't want to max out every single session and do a mad thing. Do you get what I'm saying? Yes, I would love to do that, but if I'm going to be smart, I'm going to switch to hill runs. I'll probably do five because I haven't done hill runs in ages. And we're going to start including them in the videos because it's grand season. But yeah, like I've, I did an AMRAP. I did press ups, pull ups and chin ups. And then I did static holds and dips. So yeah, basics. And I did pikes. So now we're going to do some hill runs and I'll speak to you after. But me personally, I feel like you should always include running in everything you do. And I haven't been running enough. That's literally the truth. I'm going to start running more. Obviously, it's harder to film running like videos because I record off my phone and I don't have a small camera to record off yet. But if I'm doing hill runs and stuff, I can still show you simply because it's up a hill and back down the hill. Do you get what I'm saying? So I'm probably going to do five sets. I see how it feels. I'm not going to sprint. I'm saying hill runs because I'm going off running. I'm not going to sprint it because I haven't run up hills in ages. So I'm not trying to come and do something crazy and hurt myself. So I'm going to do five hill runs, not hill sprints yet. You will notice when I change the title in however long, whatever, to hill sprints, then calm. But right now, it's not, I would say it's like 30 meters. Oh, I know you knew. 30 meters. But let's go. One. As I, as I. Guys, I did a neck. You can't see me, but I did a neck. I did. I was recording when I was going down the hill, not up the hill like a stupid idiot. So there's only one recorded. Cha. Cha. Okay, it's recording. This is number five, but for you, it's number two. That's number five. Oh, I'll do one more. All right, calm guys. I finished. I'm walking home and I'm cold, man. I'm cold, but I'm deep in that. When, um, you see how I didn't do so much today in the gym that like I didn't do bare pull ups or bare dips and stuff here. Yeah? It's simply because like, my arms was tied on Wednesday, so I said, let me take a break and I'll come on um, Thursday, which is today. I came, did my thing and I feel good. Like I still did something. Obviously I'm still getting used to the fact that um, calisthenic sessions will never be as high reps as in the gym because of what you're doing. Do you get what I'm saying? So it's like, if you did 27 pull ups, yeah, that is amazing. But if you only did 27 reps in the gym, people will look at you like, why did you bother coming to the gym? Do you get what I'm saying? So it goes both ways. But to be honest, today was a good workout. Like, I can't complain, man. There's a lion. Look. Can you see him? It's a lion. Look. Also, guys, another thing is, like, 
fam, when you're doing stuff like this, posting videos, talking about this and that, you have to believe in yourself. If you don't believe in yourself, fam, there's no point, man. Like, you ha obviously you have to be consistent and stuff, but you have to believe in your word. Do you get it? Like, I believe that if I stay consistent in this, I know I'm going to be good at calisthenics. I know I'm going to be sick at doing muscle-ups and so on. If I don't stay consistent, then that's my own. Do you get it? But I'm going to stay consistent. And yeah, guys, give me exercises, man, because still to this day, obviously I just started, but I d obviously I'm learning AMRAPs and stuff here. But apart from that, fam, I don't know what to do when you get in the gym. Do you just go there and spam pull-ups and leave? Do you go there, spam press-ups and leave? Do you get what I'm saying? But I'm starting to get a gauge. So we're gonna keep grinding, man. If you've started as well, just keep grinding. This video might not be as long as you thought it was gonna to be today, but. Bam, today, I would say it was a good workout, man. I can't be angry with that. It was good. It was, it's freezing. It's literally two degrees outside. It's probably colder right now. Where's my other phone? All right, right now, it is. It is free. Three degrees so it's like fam i could have just been like oh the bars are too cold i don't need to go but fam if you want to be good at something you have to do it no matter what and that's what i'm trying to do do it no matter what get out there no matter what i'm joking but guys make sure that comment subscribe i hope you enjoyed this video it wasn't long we did a few hill runs some pull-ups chin-ups dips press-ups pikes we're grinding it's, a st it's still a start like today i was a bit tired or well, my body was a bit tired so yeah man but i'll see you guys next time and maybe it might be a super long workout, I don't know, but in a bit.